welcome to the cloud network in this video i will show you what are the 14 things that need to you need to know about in 14.010 uh, uh, long term support so first of all the 14 things that you need to install in your ubuntu means first of all you need to have a canonical partners that is check or not after that uh, we'll do about updates and upgrade I will show you and after that what is Ubuntu restricted area Ubuntu restricted area is nothing but by default it will not come under the Ubuntu OS but you have to install it by the manual command so why it will use this for is to play different format for media purpose like mp3 mp4 and avia and other formats without any trouble so you need to install it manually, manually. so that is the Ubuntu extra, uh, restricted extras right so this is the command let me show you about first of all first we'll check about canonical partner is check or not uh, first of all you need to open your virtual box just click on show uh, after that what you have to do is we'll check for canonical update software and so this is your 14.010 ubuntu desktop if you want to make a full screen you just drag this and make a small like this so it will become a full screen so you can have it like that you can make a full screen so just uh, what do you have to do is so what do you have to do is to check canonical partner means just click on this system icon here and check here this box click on system settings or uh, there first what do you have to do is find the softwares and updates here is located softwares and updates uh, as you can see this is one and just what you have, you have to open this okay. after opening you need to check canonical partner is supported or not here is the uh, canonical supported free is checkbox and uh, check click on others here is your canonical partners check this box and give a password do you uh, assign this password click authenticate and after that check this also so that whenever you install a third party software it does not or does not ask anything about it so just click to close that one and uh, reload it while it's downloading this update x catch it now now we have checked the canonical partners now we will uh, open the terminal and type the update and update commands now just open your terminal by clicking here on search box and type here terminal to find where it, is, it will locate it and click here to find terminal yeah here is coming terminal Now just uh, login with the root. You need to type a root password here. That is fail means it does not have a, any root password set here. So we'll make a uh, set a root password for new password for root. Just type sudo and type password. Type root to set a new password for root and type the correct password for the new and then type a root password set confirm the same password and then we'll log in into the root to update our 14.010 version so just clear that one now type sudo apt hyphen get update first of all we'll update the repository uh, then we'll go for the upgrade for our packages dependencies for this installation we need to have an internet compulsory now we'll upgrade it type the above key and remove update insert of type upgrade press enter and confirm that yes yes now the first one we have is step one we have done canonical partners has been checked now the second step update and upgrade have been completed now i will show you about this open to restrict extra uh, we need to manually type this
command to have a, a, a media format play mp3 like mp4 in ubuntu let me show you this so this one is updated so type player to update now just open this one press above type press up key and then type here uh, ubuntu give a hyphen uh, type res ticket press it type uh, to complete the key and then move to here so we need to install that uh, ubuntu rest ticket type ubuntu install and then type hyphen res ticket press tab to confirm the uh, key so you need to type uh, sudo apt hyphen install ubuntu rest ticket extra after typing press enter and then after you need to confirm this contain installation it will after this operation 151 mb it will take so press y to continue uh, remember please remember before continue your installation uh, you need to have a free space of your rds 25 gb and you need to have internet installation and now we need to install adobe flash flare for your video playing plugins you need to require like for example you can take a youtube videos that you need to have a, a flash flare to install it first of all let's get to install this flash flare now you can see this or uh, rusticate installation has been finished now we'll install the flash flare plugins just remove this uh, open to rusticate in place will type flash now after typing this sudo apt uh, happen install flash plugin happen install just press enter so here it will be confirmed to enter the installation press yes to continue and now we'll move to the step fifth that is enable edge scrolling that for use for your mouse and setting purpose let me show you first of all just click on this system icon meter can go to system settings and uh, what you will need to open the system settings right here under this mic and uh, you have to find your uh, mouse and pad here is a touchpad mouse is showing and just double click or you will see here is uh, you want button primary left or right click and you want to double fast to slow this is your test your setting is there if you want to test it if you want to have other things or you can check it out that one after setting the mouse settings you need to if you want to install drawbacks means a dropbox or and you want to fix this indicator issue means uh, this is a command to fix and install the drop a drop dropbox and after that you need to restart your computer let me show you how to install dropbox and qt panel if you want to remove the keyboard from unity panel i need to go to settings and there's text and uncheck the show current input as source in a menu bar let me show you all this then after i'm going to fix the brightness issue for enter graphics purpose if you want to fix and then you can install the vlc and then we can install the wrap now click on this computer can go to system settings to remove the keyboard panel from the search bar and then you uh, need to find the text entry uh, here is your text entry double click to open and there here you need to uncheck the show current input source in the menu bar uncheck this one box and then go to back uh, to check your about this one which uh, brightness like if you want to set a brightness means uh, here is your brightness about turn screen for five minutes inactive means screen turn off in quite a password if you want to check the for purpose and here is your appearance it is there which uh, you can check your wallpaper you want to set which this current background size location contrast here you can set your uh, launcher icon size also like you want to have small icons just like that it will set small icons and then you can click on this behavior also to have enabled wordpress add show icon desktop to the launch or this re install in the menu 
like show the menu for the windows or in the you can click on this one to have a in the windows menu title bar so after that you need to click all settings again to lock about this uh, on privacy security I will show you this one also and this is for your storing your access data whatever you are browsing on this one it will be storage here only like walking this return from blank screen and here is your chart if you chart document picture but all those things store here only if you want to clear means you can clear if you put off means it will be put off it does not store anything your data your on this settings privacy just search bar and this is a diagnostic uh, if you uncheck this means it doesn't send you any errors about this uh, uh, clinical report to desert report to a clinical so I'm checking it's very good for you so you get frequency that will error repeated repeated and this is your display uh, which show you about uh, uh, this monitor size and this resolution normal and this is your all display color is there it checks if you detect means normally it can detect and here is your printer settings there the sound and this is the color which uh, high color true color is there this is keyboard layout this is your network which you can check about which internet is using access see is a wire connected or your LAN connected uh, this is your app data shown so click if you want to put a app you can put a off for the internet this airplane one and you want to go for the options you can set if you want to add means click here to add and then here is your user account to have a check about how many user has been created or not if you want to uh, log in automatically you can check here your history it will show you uh, just unlock it and do the changes about the uh, change in the password adding user also account here's the details about your ubuntu uh, system data hardware show it will show you configuration hardware configuration in these details like is showing about this and everything show size hard disk size processor this is a time and date this is a battery this is sound is checking so now we are going to install the uh, dropper type netulis dropbox press enter to install the dropbox the press yes to continue to install a now the dropbox installation is completed click on start click on click on store dropbox and then here is your dropbox symbol you can see this is your Dropbox. Just see. So this is a Dropbox. Now, in this way, you can install VLC and RAR also, and also you can install Skype also. So let me show you. Now, you can install the VLC by from terminal also, or you can install like typing sudo app and install VLC. And you can install RAR also here by typing RAR and you can install your Skype also by typing in Skype and one more thing you can install from terminal plus you can install from your uh, Ubuntu software center you need to type VLC here and just search here you get a VLC uh, per click you can install the same thing you can install the Skype also type in the Skype so you to be such a so here is the skype so you can install the skype also but here is your ubuntu software center just open and search or type it so you get all these things now you need to uh, install additional software drivers means uh, what you have to do is so now if you want to install the additional drivers means ubuntu to uh, uh, 10 means uh, you need to search for these additional drivers let me show you and after that if you want to improve the battery lifetime and uh, reduce the hour it needs you need to type this command let me show you and uh, just click to the computer open and go to system settings and there uh, you need to find about this software updates click on that one software updates and the find now 
after opening the software and updates here go to additional drivers and check here if it is showing you something here just you need to apply and changes the here if you get anything additional drivers like graphic cards internet sound drivers if you show you any other things update that you need to install means just uh, uh, install and apply the changes and uh, just click on and we'll check for this uh, to make a bad improve your battery performance and uh, you know to reduce the overheating means uh, just type these commands sudo apt hyphen respiratory ppa and you know, ppa that will be add to a respiratory line line of tpl after that update it and install the tpl key tpl wallet and after that we need to start let me show you. we need to log in with the into the root type as you have a one two three password and then do you know by typing this command let me just press it to install the tree tool Now we are going to install genome, just replace the unity in place of genome, type G N O N E M E N O. press enter, install that when tips of Ubuntu 14.0.10 latest version of things we have, I have shown you about these updates configurations, please subscribe to the product, thank you for watching.